What is up, you horror nerds? It is me, your host, Jeremiah Duncan. Welcome back. I bring you yet another Ruggiero Diodato film. This one from the 1977 pseudo-classic, Jungle Holocaust. Hey! So, this one here, I really enjoyed. If you haven't heard this film, this is the first in what they call his trilogy of cannibal movies. They're not in order, they don't go together or anything, but this is the first one he released. Of course, the second one was The Infamous, which means more than famous, Cannibal Holocaust. If you've never heard of Jungle, let's talk about it. A small plane carrying Robert Harper and his friend Rolf crash lands into an isolated development in New Guinea. After the pilot and his female companion are killed by a tribe of cannibals, the two friends on the run are separated and Robert is captured by the rival tribe who may not be cannibals but are cruel and primitive beyond belief. Tortured and humiliated, Robert is taken to the edge of sanity by a series of acts so horrible that they are practically beyond, beyond human comprehension. Only the fact that they are um, only the fact that the one of the tribe woman women oh. sympathizes with him. She gives Robert the strength to plan a desperate escape, but standing in his way back to civilization are the cannibal tribes responsible for the death of his crew members. This cannibal classic directed by, directed by Ruggiero Diodato um, played all over America as the last survivor in an edited form. Now watch this classic uncut, much like many of the penises you see in this movie, from the glorious 2017 HD Master. Now... Again, Diodato is one of my favorites. I give this a 7 out of 10. you got to watch it. got to have it for the collection for the sole fact that he directed it. However, there's some queasy scenes in here if you don't like it. I mean, it's a typical Diodato film. So um, if simulated rape and um, nudity and um, actually there's some animal mutilation in here. There's like an, a lot, like some of it's National Geographic stuff. But some of it is like alligator, push, and they bash it in the head, and then they cut it open, and it was alive. I mean, is it things that primitive people probably did? Yeah, but it was real animal cruelty. So those scenes were a little rough. But if you can gulp or squint through it, um, if those aren't your things, it's definitely worth a watch. It's a fun movie. It's a good one. Um, I mean... <laughs> It's a Cannibal Holocaust prequel, if you will. He was, he was prepping himself, getting it ready. Anyway, Jungle Holocaust, 7 out of 10, 1977, classic. Check it out. If you've seen it, comment below. Let me know what you thought. What's, a, what's another Cannibal movie you're into? Let me know. I'd love to check it out, and I'll review it. Have a good one.